the thing is uh, for example uh, uh, yesterday yesterday we discussed uh, example uh, posting uh, posting period variant and even we discussed the uh, field status variant every month even i explained in the class okay i explained in the class then whenever you have the time like not only posting period and physical year or not only this every day we are discussing a specific topic we are going to discuss after uh, listening of my class even you can browse in the google also okay for example yesterday we discussed what is meant by field status variant today we will do the configuration maybe you you will get one picture based on that picture even you can browse in the google what is in the google no problem just check it out yeah. and yeah. finally go on mute yeah. please go on mute please don't disturb okay so whenever you have the time just browse it so instead of watching youtube videos instead of watching youtube shorts so avoid all social media activities until get the job okay so this is my request everyone so every day don't miss any class okay in case of any other uh, uh, plannings you have just to postpone three to hare krishna who is it go on mute uh -huh. madam please go on mute madam hare krishna let it be uh can <coughs> hare krishna <coughs> everyone uh, yesterday i can give a note everyone regarding to uh, uh, feel, guys don't disturb the class everyone i am special request okay and uh, yeah uh, can anyone please read the note yesterday i can give uh, what is meant by uh, field status variant and all so my intention is before going to read the note my intention is first listen the class note it down properly based on the practice material you can practice then every class we are uploading into the google drive once again if you have any doubts once again you can watch the google drive videos okay then uh, you can in case of any doubts you can browse it search engines also you can take one notes okay then any any sap related doubts you can reach out me at any point of time okay uh, please don't disturb the class everyone i am special request to everyone please okay so now you can uh, read the note anyone who can read who will read hello ah, sir ma swarna ma'am thank you ma'am please read the note ma'am yesterday we given na entire field status sir ha ah, entire field. field status please read in case of any uh, thing then i can give the no in case of any addicts i can tell you okay please read no madam field status variant is control field Slow, slowly moving. madam <laughs> slowly with loud voice yeah please okay sir field status variant is control field during the accounting entry postings next every field we have four options required uh, optional display surplus surpluses uh, required if you activate required of specific field bracket open business area or uh, bracket open segment uh, during the accounting entry postings end user must want to enter segment uh, or must want to enter specific field uh, without uh, required input systems cannot allow to post the accounting entry or document entry optional if you specified any field as as a optional during the accounting entry postings that field is optional we may enter in uh, enter the inputs or we may not enter the inputs system in allow display any field if you make as a display that field is just display mode we are unable to enter the inputs surplus uh, whatever field we will make as a surplus the field unable to 
visible during the accounting entry postings. Okay. Yeah. <coughs> everyone, concentrated everyone. Very simple everyone. Very simple understanding. Just one word answer I can give you. Thank you ma'am. Thank you. So one word answer I can give you everyone. Field status variant means as a consultant we are control the end users they during the accounting entry posting which field they want to enter the inputs which field they don't want to enter the inputs which field is optional maybe enter or may, may not enter which field is required we are controlling from here got it my point so for example uh, means we need to control the end users actually we need to control the end users okay so uh, can you please note it down these two steps also everyone first one define field status variant then assign field status variant assign company code to field status variant can you please note it down this also these two steps just headings you can note it down define field status variant and assign company code to field status variant done everyone noted yes no okay please yes sir. yes right <coughs> everyone concentrate here everyone concentrate here everyone very very important everyone so this is the path define field status variant including the groups okay this is the path everyone spro financial accounting new financial accounting global setting new ledgers and fields define field status variant the very 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 important everyone let it be somebody send message <coughs> yeah so everyone concentrate everyone go to spro enter sap reference img and uh, select here financial accounting new and financial accounting global setting new then ledgers and fields means we are we want to control the fields which fields end user accounting entry posting fields that is our target everyone example fields and uh, this one this one everyone these two steps define field status variant assign company code to field status variant so this is the path financial accounting new financial accounting global setting ledgers fields and define field status variant so what is the t code how we can see the t code go to additional information additional information display this keys and img activities this is the path actually this is the path so click on here this execute <coughs> And that's going on browse. <coughs> the last four digit is the T code everyone. Last four digit is the T code. OBC4 and OBC5. This is the T. Define field status variant. T code is called OBC4. Assign a company code to field status variant. T code is called OBC5. Everyone, in case, in case if you want to understand more information, what is mean by field status, why field status, what is the purpose of field status, just go through this document. So this is the document can explain more information regarding to the field status variant. So in case of whenever you have the time, whenever you have the time, just analyze this documents also everyone. Whenever you have time, just you must analyze these documents also. Why, what, when, all the information will tell here. Okay, SAP uh, 
SAP provided information every information will going to provide here okay so whenever you have the time just go and look into this okay <coughs> everyone now okay so finally we want to edit everyone concentrate here everyone you just double click on this execute button you just double click on this execute button you just double click on this execute button it's going on browse everyone concentrate here everyone here here triple zero one triple zero one is on a standard field status variant in case if you want to use triple zero one you can use it no problem but sir i don't want to use the standard sir i want to create my own so how to create very simple everyone select here triple zero one select here triple zero one click on here copy ash click on here copy ash set up here any four digit and write the description what is the any four digit it may be numerical or it may be alphabets okay so example here uh, jm for pm right pm uh, uh, fv uh, field status variant for pm and press enter press enter enter then copy all you must click on here copy all all the groups will copied from 3001 to pm fv yes save <clears throat> everyone concentrate here everyone how to create the variant very simple everyone how to create the variant i'm i'm repeating once again everyone for my satisfaction i'm repeating once again so everyone concentrate here everyone you just double click on this execute button you just double click on this execute button and uh, click on here triple zero one click on here copy as and set up here any four digit and write the description press enter copy all then save copy all and save so what we created just now we created use paste down button pm pm where is that pm fv pm fv this one we created everyone now you can concentrate here everyone select here pm fv double click on field status group so this is the field status groups everyone g001 3456 this is the group section for example double click on g001 and this is the fields example general data this is some fields this is the fields surplus required and optional and uh, example additional accounting information this is the fields where this fields is available this is the fields available during the accounting entry posting for example for example here here example everyone here business area example business area here i can put as a required what is mean by that during the accounting entry posting you must to want to enter the business area for example here if i want to put as a optional what happened during the accounting entry posting you may enter the business area or you may not enter the business area why because it's optional for example for example everyone for example example i am telling for example you are the wipro employee example i will tell you everyone example i will tell you you are the wipro employee wipro employee as a consultant as a consultant and you are implementing pm group of company pm group of company so pm group of company is your client so as a consultant you need to take the confirmation from your client you need to take the confirmation your client you can ask mail confirmation 
during the accounting entry postings so which fields they required which fields the optional you can take the confirmation from the your client based on that confirmation you can you need to do the setups here example in the practicing purpose business area you will make as a optional then profit center you will make as a optional then one more uh, segment also you can take uh, segment you can make as a optional then click on here save and back click on here save and back everyone i am repeating once again everyone listen careful listen careful everyone why because this is very important how we did come to this path come to this path double click on this execute button example i am taking three fields but in the real time based on the client confirmation you need to make as a their information which fields we will make as optional required surprise whatever you want okay <clears throat> so select here your variant pm 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 where is that pm fv double click on field status group and example g001 uh, additional accounting information and example i will make business area is i put as a optional profit center i put as a optional you space down and again ah. you space down. hare krishna please go on mute everyone please please everyone please don't disturb the class and the segment segment you will make as a optional so these three things you will make as a optional everyone okay and click on your save and back <coughs> everyone concentrate everyone how it's look like example how it look like everyone uh, uday ji please go on mute uday sir please please sir please go on mute everyone how it look like concentrate everyone what is the configuration flow what is the configuration flow means first we will create field status first we will create field status variant what is that pm pm uh, fv so this field status variant we can assign to our company codes uh, pm 10 and pm 20 pm20 we will assign to our company codes we will assign to our company codes and based on this field status variant it is including field status group it is including field status group example example g001 example g001 g003 45 different different and this this field status group we are assigning into the gl account we are assigning into the gl accounts gl accounts gl account based on the gl account we will post the accounting entries we will post the document entries or accounting entries accounting entries based on the document entries we will generate the reports we will generate the reports reports okay so now we successfully created this we successfully created this and now next step is we want to assign our field status variant to our company code then later during the gl creation during the gl creation i will show you how to assign this groups to in the gl master data then later i will show you how to post the accounting entries or document entries then reports each and every point we are going to discuss okay and please note it down field status variant configuration flow you can note it down field status variant configuration flow note it down everyone field status variant configuration flow please note it down
Done? Noted? Done? Yeah. yeah. <coughs> the next step. Next step is assign company code to field status variant. Assign company code to field status variant. Same path everyone. Same path. Basically next step. Next step. Assign company code to field status variant. Same path. Financial accounting new. Financial accounting global setting. Ledgers, fields, assign company code to field status variant. T code is called OBC5. OBC5. So you just double click on this execute button and uh, click on your position. What is your company code? Tell me. Uh, PM10. <coughs> so this is your company code. And uh, here you want to assign your field status variant. What is your field status variant? PMFV. PMFV. Yeah. So in case PMFV. In case everyone, in case if you are not remember. So what can I do? So here you just click on your browse or F4. Press F4. So all the field status variants it will come. In case if you want to use the standard 3001, you can use it. Okay. No, sir, I don't want to use. I can use my own. So what is that? PMFV. PMFV. So press enter and save. So this is my company codes and this is my field status variant. <coughs> Everyone, now time to ask the doubts. It's time to ask the questions. Sir? Uh, Antony Raj, tell me sir. Sir, in case uh, we need to standard method. How can you uh, save sir, that one? Huh. Because to your you can, zero zero one. You can, in case in the standard, if you want to change anything, you can click on your save. It will going to save. Okay. Don't use the standard. You can create your own. Okay. Okay. Sir. Okay. Next one. Uh, sir, uh, what is the difference between a uh, field status variant and field status group? Uh, basically, field status variant is uh, combination of field status groups. Okay. Next one. Uh, sir, another doubt. Hmm. Sir, in case I save. Uh, tier, we are saving the tier. Different tier, what happened? This question. At tier. Hmm. Tell me, tier? I did not understand. Uh, can I have a problem? Actually, uh, another tier number. How uh, can <laughs> that's, we edit That's sir? not a problem. In Actually, in the real time, in the real time, we want uh, to take care. We need to save correct tier. Okay. And in okay, the during okay. practicing purpose, if you save another tier, also no problem. Okay, we are doing same client now. It's no problem. That's fine. <coughs> yeah. No doubts. Then put the heading of one more tolerance. Put the heading of tolerance, everyone. Put the heading of tolerance. Tolerance. <coughs> um, anyone can you um, just you just leave the SAP. Can anyone explain uh, define? Can anyone define what is meant by tolerance? Do you just leave the SAP. Just give me meaning of tolerance. Define that. Uh, tolerance means limits within the limits. Limit, okay. Okay. Any others? Anyone? Uh, 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 Hurry, go on mute. Uh. Grace. Yeah, please go ahead. Somebody, can I ask? 
Grace, sir. Madam, come again, madam. Grace, Grace. Mm, no, madam. Grace, no. Sacrificing. Ah, very good. Mm -hmm. When, Endurance. When you, uh, I'm uh, leaving. Endurance. Endurance, okay, okay. Okay. <coughs> everyone, I will tell you one thing, everyone. I will tell you one thing. Um, I will tell you one thing, everyone. Basically, basically, um, I want to, I want to receive, I want to receive payment. <coughs> I want to receive the payment. Uh, one crore, one crore, one crore, uh, two rupees. One crore, two rupees. So they paid only one crore. So if you if you leave, if you sacrifice this two rupees or not? Everyone say yes, no, please, please, everyone. So maybe yes. Answer yes, is yes. Sir. Answer is yes. yes. So maybe we don't care these two rupees when you collecting the one crore. For example, everyone. For example, everyone. During the payment, I am saying. During the payment. Payment means maybe vendor payment or maybe customer payment. So here, what happened? You are sacrificing the two rupees. So you are sacrificing the two rupees. Every transaction two rupees for one lakh transaction. How many rupees it will come? You can see uh, Upper Chitadu movie. It's a old movie actually, Vikram movie. For every person one rupee. For one crore person how many? Ten crore how many? Like that. In the business, actually, if you in the business, if you take very big big companies, every day they will do lakhs of transactions for month. How many transaction? Each transaction one rupee or two rupee. How many values will come? Okay. So each and every rupee is very important in the business. Okay. So for example, everyone. For example. So we want to pay to the customer. We want to pay the customer thousand rupees point maybe uh, thirty paisa. 1000 rupees point 30 paisa we want to pay but we paid only 1000 rupees what happened so this 30 paisa this 30 paisa they will sacrifice this 30 paisa we will they will sacrifice everyone during the payments during the payment sacrifice <coughs> Example everyone tolerance means exact uh, tolerance means <coughs> Everyone concentrate here everyone concentrate here concentrate here everyone tolerance means In the configuration level in the configuration level We will set up one limit. We will set up one limit Example my limit is 10 rupees My limit is my company limit is Company limit is 10 rupees. Company limit is example 10 rupees. I maintain the limit 10 rupees. Everyone concentrate here, everyone. Now, during the payment, maybe customer payment or vendor payment, anything, whatever. During the payment, I have to receive or I have to pay anything. Customer payment or vendor payment anything during the payment. I want to pay Thousand rupees. I want to pay have to pay thousand rupees But I paid but I paid uh, 995 rupees 995 rupees So what happened here? What is the difference value? have to minus paid how much difference value difference value is 5 rupees difference value is 5 rupees so this differences is less than my limit 
no problem system is allowed no problem system is allowed okay you can excuse them for example i paid 998 rupees the difference is 2 rupees okay system is allowed i paid 1000 rupees difference is zero system is allowed in case everyone in case concentrate in case i paid 989 rupees what is the difference is difference is 11 rupees how much my limit my limit is 10 rupees only how much my limit my limit is 10 rupees only it means our payment differences is exceed of my limit then system cannot allow system cannot allow this value going to outstanding system cannot allow system will say go and collect the amount system is say go and collect the amount so everyone i will i will repeat everyone i will tell you once again concentrate here tolerance means tolerance means we will set up one limit we will set up one limit during the payment accounting entry postings during the payment accounting entry posting you can sacrifice the value up to that limit you can sacrifice the value up to that limit in case if you sacrifice more than that limit system cannot allow system cannot allow system says go and collect the amount means we are controlling the end users we are controlling the end users we are not giving access to the end users how much they want to tolerate tolerance sacrificing we can controlling payment differences payment differences example this is my invoice value example this is my invoice value 1000 rupees my payment value payment value payment value is 989 rupees difference is 11 rupees but my limit is only 10 rupees system won't allow for example i paid 995 rupees difference is 5 rupees then okay acceptable chalo theek hai chhod do bhai chalo excuse them and i paid 999 1 rupees difference chalo theek hai excuse them you can sacrifice the value why because this is 1 rupee 2 rupees 3 rupees this is under my limit more than my limit more than my limit system cannot accept sir who can give this limit who can give this limit you need to ask your client you need to ask your client your client is provided the limit your client is provided the limit based on your client inform confirmation you need to set up one limit so your payment differences less than this limit system can allow more than this limit system cannot allow note it down everyone put the heading of tolerance and note it down tolerance and note it down for simple understanding okay anyway later i will share you interview question and answers that is a different for simple understanding you can note it down one note everyone tolerance means tolerance means in the configuration level <coughs> tolerance means in the configuration level we will set up one limit in the configuration level ah uh, sorry in the configuration level based on the client confirmation we will set up one limit
we will set up one limit during the payment accounting entry postings during the payment accounting entry postings we are possible to we are possible to sacrifice the value sacrifice the value up to that limit up to that limit Sorry, sir. Can you repeat again? Second point. Sacrifice the value up to that limit. In case, in case. If try to sacrifice. in case if you try to sacrifice more than our limit more than our limit more than our limit system cannot allow system cannot allow next line note it down put the star and note it down put the star and note it down put the star and note it down next line it means it means the payment differences value payment differences value payment differences value always less than our limit in case in case in case payment differences value payment differences differences okay payment differences value more than our limit system cannot allow to post next line note it down types of tolerances next line note it down types of tolerances 
one is employee tolerance one is employee tolerance sorry uh, anyway gl tolerance employee tolerance vendor tolerance and customer tolerance anyway you up and down no problem okay gl tolerance employee tolerance vendor tolerance and customer tolerance this is the four, four things Swarna ma'am, can you please read the note ma'am? Tolerance spelling. Tolerance means in the configuration level based on the client. Client after sir. Client confirmation. Uh, client confirmation. We will set up limit duration during the payment. Accounting entry post. Madam, madam. We are. Madam, one second, one second. There is a comma full stop, madam. You 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 are going to confuse. Uh, basically, what happened? Based on the client confirmation, we are set up one limit. Full stop. Full stop. And uh, during yes, the payment accounting yes, entry posting, like that. Okay, you can read. Yes, during the payment accounting entry posting, we are possible to. Sacrifice the value up to that limit. Mm. Yeah. In case if you try sacrifice more than our limit, system cannot allow. Next, it means the payment differences value allow always less than our limit. In case payment differences value more than our limit, system cannot allow to the to post. Tolerance, tolerance, employee tolerance, GL tolerance, tolerance vendor tolerance, customer tolerance. Customer tolerance. Very good, madam. Everyone, one second. I will repeat just one minute. Just simple terminology. I can limit everyone. Very simple terminology, everyone. Concentrate, everyone. <coughs> Very simple terminology. Very simple, everyone. What is meant by tolerance? Means in the configuration level. In the configure, everyone. Concentrate here, everyone. What is meant by tolerance means in the configuration level, we will set up one limit, everyone. Who will give this limit? Based on the client confirmation, we will set up one limit. When this limit will going to reflected, that is the question actually. When this limit will going to reflected. This is the limit can be reflected during the payment accounting entry posting. During the payment accounting entry posting, invoice posting and the payment posting, invoice posting and payment posting. So this is the limit will reflected during the payment accounting entry posting. The invoice value against of invoice value we will post the payment. So if if your payment value, in case if your payment value differences with invoice value, in case if your payment value differences less than our limit, system is allowed. More than our limit, system cannot allow. Means you are going to sacrifice the value up to that limit. payment differences value you can sacrifice maybe customer payment or maybe vendor payment okay so let's do the configuration after the configuration in case of any doubts we can can you please note it down this everyone can you please note it down 
define tolerance group for the gl accounts define tolerance group for the employees assign user to tolerance group assign user to tolerance group note it down these headings everyone define tolerance group for the gl accounts define tolerance group for the employees assign user to tolerance group so this is gl tolerances employee tolerances so vendor tolerances will come accounts payable customer tolerance will come on accounts receivable okay not required now done everyone noted yes no okay yes yes sir maybe maybe you you got my point so here in the configuration we want to set up one limit who will give that limit the client will be provided you can ask your client your client will be provided okay you are implementing your client project actually you are implementing your client you are the example example i am telling everyone example you are the wipro employee you are implementing pm group of company pm group of companies your client okay like that okay so uh, this is define tolerance group for the gl accounts define tolerance group for the gl accounts okay so everyone concentrate here everyone so what is the this is the first one define tolerance group for the gl account so this is the path everyone spro financial accounting new general ledger accounting new business transaction open item clearing and clearing differences define tolerance group for the gl accounts define tolerance group for the gl accounts this is the path actually okay let's do that so one second everyone <clears throat> spro enter sap reference img select your uh, financial accounting new financial accounting new and uh, general ledger accounting new and uh, business transaction and uh, open item clearing then clearing differences clearing differences this one everyone this is the one define tolerance group for the gl accounts define tolerance group for the gl account so what is the t code what is the t code and uh, go to additional information once again additional information additional information display keys and img activities so last four digit is the t code actually uh, ob a0 ob a4 ob57 last four digit is the t code okay so this is the path financial accounting new general ledger accounting new business transaction open item clearing clearing differences this one define tolerance group for the gl account everyone concentrate everyone concentrate here so you just double click on this execute button double click on this execute button and click on your new entry click on your new entry everyone debit posting and credit posting debit means expenses or loss credit means incomes or gain incomes or gain everyone concentrate here everyone concentrate here everyone uh, example incoming payments example incoming payments incoming payment 
इनकमिंग पेमेंट मीन्स पेमेंट हैव टू रिसीव पेमेंट हैव टू रिसीव I want to received everyone. Please respond, everyone. Here I will ask one question. I have to receive thousand rupees, but uh, I I have to receive thousand rupees, but I received only nine hundred and ninety eight rupees. So these two rupees, uh, income or loss? Any loss? Huh? Loss. 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 Sacrifice. Loss. Loss means debit or credit. Debit. 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 So debit transaction means it can be reflected for the incoming payments. Then credit transaction means everyone concentrate here. I have outgoing payment. Example, outgoing payment. Out. Going payment. i want to pay example i want to pay i want to pay 200 rupees example i want to pay 200 rupees but i paid only 99 rupees i want to pay i want to pay to 200 rupees to swarna ma'am so but i paid only 99 rupees and 1 uh, rupee what about 1 rupee income or loss In income it's so gain income i want to pay 200 rupees but i paid only 99 rupees even this in 1 rupees income income means debit or credit so one not one sir one sir one sir one 199 okay one double nine Here one double nine. Okay, I I want to pay two hundred, but I paid only one double one nine nine. So difference is is one rupee. So this one rupee income or gain? Income credit. Income बोले तो credit. Credit. So what you people want to understand? This credit posting means it can be reflected outgoing payments. Debit posting means it can be reflected incoming payments. Okay, got it. My point. So I'm repeating one second, everyone. I'm repeating one second. As well, Dharma. Guys, please go on mute, everyone. Please. As well, Dharma. I think you. Ah, Bhaskar, please go on mute, my dear friend. <laughs> Sorry, sir. <clears throat> Everyone, incoming payment, incoming payment differences, incoming payment differences is going to loss. So, huh? incoming payment differences is loss. Incoming, coming, incoming payment differences is loss. Loss बोले तो debit. Outgoing payment, outgoing payment differences is Gain, example gain, gain बोले तो income, gain बोले तो credit, loss बोले तो debit, loss बोले तो debit, gain बोले तो credit. So what you people want to understand? Debit posting means it difference. It can be reflected incoming payment and outgoing payment. This is outgoing. This is incoming. Do you got my point, everyone? Can I repeat one second? Yes, no. Got it. Got understood, sir. Understood. Okay. <clears throat> everyone, concentrated. Everyone, now come to this path. Come to this path. Double click on this execute button. Double click on this execute button. Click on your new entry. then enter your company code company code is called pm10 then don't enter any information into the group field why because we are maintaining at company code level not in the group level don't enter any information in the group and uh, write the description example tolerance group underscore pm10 we are maintain at company code level 
and debit posting 10 rupees or 1% 1% of invoice value whichever is less okay 10 rupees or 1% so this limit will provided by your uh, uh, client okay press enter and save then one more one more click on your next click on your next pm20 then uh, tolerance group for the pm20 20 10 rupees or 1% 10 rupees or 1% enter and save Don't enter any information into the group field. Why? Because we are maintaining at company code level. The next one. Next one. Define tolerance limit. Define tolerance group for the employee. Define tolerance group for the employee. Everyone, concentrate here everyone. Concentrate here everyone. I will tell you one example everyone. I will tell you one example 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 everyone very important everyone example uh, <clears throat> I example which example I want to give yeah let it be for example everyone general normal example I can give you uh, I can go for shopping I example generally we are going to shopping now uh, we are going shopping to any any example shopper stop shopper stop or shopper stop any lot of malls is there this is shopper stop is the shopping mall actually shopper stop is the shopping mall example example here here my friend is the salesman my friend is the salesman what happened maybe i can get up to maybe five to six percent up to ten percent of discount why because my friend is the salesman example my friend is the supervisor supervisor okay my friend is the supervisor and what happened maybe you can get up to 20 percent of discount my friend is the supervisor in case my friend is the my friend is the manager in case my friend is the manager maybe you can get up to 50 percent of discount discount means tolerance you can sac they will sacrifice the value i mean uh, you your manager is ceo your manager is CEO. Maybe they will sacrifice hundred percent of value. Maybe, maybe they can sacrifice hundred percent of value. So what happened here? What you people want to understand? Based on the designation, based on the employee designation, their sacrificing values or their limits, postings values will going to change posting values is going to change maybe your friend is salesman you can get up to 10 percent of sacrificing they will sacrifice the value up to 10 percent supervisor maybe they will sacrifice up to 20 percent manager okay they will manage up to 50 percent even ceo will manage 100 percent maybe maybe 100 percent means based on the employee the sacrificing value is going to difference their sacrificing value is difference i will tell you one more scenario everyone i will tell you one more scenario example example uh, i am the manager i am the manager under me we have one accountant and one senior accountant senior accountant 
so i am giving one instruction i am giving one instruction to the accountant for example for example up to the accounting entry value up to 1 lakh up to 1 lakh you can post the accounting entry you can verify and post the accounting entry then up to 1 crore up to 1 crore then you can post the accounting entry why because any 1 crore value will come you can send to your senior accountant senior accountant can verify and post the accounting entries then up up to 10 crores up to 10 crores manager will handle he will verify and post the accounting entries means the group level we are we are controlling the accountants we are controlling the accountants different different groups we can create in case if you want then we can assign to specific user we can assign to specific user we are as a consultant we are control the account uh, accountants we are control the end users accountant nothing but end user so so for this accountant how much value they want to post how much credit sales they want to give how much sacrificing they are going to do senior accountant how much they are going to sacrifice manager how much they are going to sacrifice okay like this you can contact your client your client will be give the confirmation based on that you need to set up okay please note it down any doubts i can give you time that time you can ask this one everyone define tolerance group for the employee define tolerance group for the employee and uh, so come to this part same part t code is called oba4 and uh, double click on this execute button guys this is the configuration level everyone do at the time of accounting entry posting each and every point we will discuss for example if i post any accounting entry dates coming from where gls coming from where currency types coming from where you need to analyze field status groups how will be reflected during the accounting entry posting you people can analyze each and every configuration steps there okay so first now you people can understand what is mean by that how to configure during the accounting entry posting you will get more and more information that time i will explain once again if you want so come to this path double click on this execute button click on here new new entry so example in case if in case if you want to maintain tolerance at group employee level different different groups you can maintain then you can assign to specific user okay in case if you want to maintain at company code level not required to maintain any group here simply you can give directly company code pm10 here amount for document maximum how much value of accounting entry they want to post example you can take any big amount uh, 99999 you can take some big amount you can take okay for the testing purpose amount for open item amount for open item accounting item open item means outstanding value credit sales credit purchases so how much limit you can give to specific user example here also you can take some big amount maximum maximum cash discount for line item maximum 10% he had control up to 10% how much value they are going to sacrifice 
मे बी टेन रुपीज और वन परसेंट ऑफ इन वॉइस वैल्यू टेन रुपीज और वन परसेंट ऑफ इन वॉइस वैल्यू प्रेस एंटर एंड सेव यू नीड टू एंटर नाइन नाइन काम some comma pull stop you need to do like that yeah. <coughs> okay so this is the per document per open item maximum this this much discount they are possible to give and the sacrificing value up to 10 rupees or 1% of invoice value press enter and save the next one next one next pm20 then press enter then save so we are we are maintaining at company code level not group level in the practicing purpose in case if they want you can maintain different different groups you can assign to different different users end users in case if they want otherwise you can maintain at company code level it can be applicable for all users okay the next step next step everyone assign user to tolerance group you just double click on this execute button and click on your new entry here you can give your username then don't enter any information into the tolerance group i did not maintain any information into the group here simply click on your new entry here you can give your username and your tolerance group i did not maintain any information into the tolerance group in case if you maintain you can assign here you, i am not maintain anything so you can keep it as this i already maintain actually this is my username sap user wherever you take an sap access na online or offline so something they will give you your username and password click on your new entry you can give it here your username press enter and save okay this is the one so vendor tolerances will come on the accounts payable customer tolerances will come on the Uh, accounts receivable okay now time to ask the doubts everyone questions who is vani vani who is vani i am sir you can call me after the class ma okay sir uh anyone now time to ask the doubts Can we change the limits after the completion? Louder, completion? louder. Speak louder, my dear friend. Sir, can we change the limits for real? Later, you can extend. Yeah, the... later. You can. In case if you want to change, you can change it. Yeah. Answer is yes. Tell me, Sailesh ji, you want any questions? So my, my question is that is to. Yeah. My yeah. My question is that is tolerance. always in terms of monetary value or we can you know set the tolerance for for example in for the creation of vendor master can we define the employees who will be responsible for creating that in the tolerance no this is the tolerance is applicable only for the payment accounting entry purpose okay not for the master data creation purpose yeah next question Sir, so, Venkat here. So the the changing of tolerance limit and everything uh, in the back end, all the consultants will have access to the super access. They'll provide for one or two people to uh, maintain the confidentiality and that uh, tolerance limit. Ah, uh, come again, sir. Come again. I am unable to hear. So this is a tolerance limit change. Hmm. So whenever we are configuring after that, as one of one of friend asks, so in between, if they want to change. No, no. So this change means actually. Ah, uh, let complete your question. I will say. Yeah, please, please. Ah, so 
this changing the tolerance limit will have access to all the SAP consultants or is there any specific user where yeah. they only change the tolerance limit? Good question, good question. For example, if you maintain the groups, if you maintain at the group level, that group you can assign to specific user, that limit applicable for only specific user. If you maintain at company code level, it can be applicable for all. Okay. Yeah, good. Good. Sir, any profit this, sir? Any ma'am? Profit? Any profit or loss, sir? Tolerance limit. Tolerance limit, uh, I, I already said you know, ma'am. If it is loss, then debit if it is gain it's going credit like that okay. yeah. I tell this right? yeah ma'am tell me can we set up uh, different different tolerance amount for the different different uh, uh, amount answer is yes okay yeah answer is yes ma'am for example different different groups you can create multiple groups you can create Okay, you will show that live example uh, in coming See, day. So here we maintain an uh, example SPRO SAP reference IMC select here financial accounting new uh, tell me everyone general ledger accounting new business transaction open item clearings and clearing differences and see these two steps you try to understand define tolerance group for the employee for example you just double click on here click on here new entry so here you can maintain example uh, g example you can set up any four digit and i am set up uh, g001 example you can set up any four digit it may be numerical or it may be alphabets so here you can maintain your company code pm10 then here you can set up one limit here you can set up one limit okay and here you can set up one limit here i am maintaining g001 and press enter and save so this limit example i am not saving okay so this g001 example next step assigned to the uh, user assigned to the user this here if i assign g001 example g001 so whatever limit I maintain in the G001, that limit applicable for only this user. Okay. In case G double next click on your save and next G002, 3, 4, 5, 6. You can maintain different different value. In case if you are not maintain any group, you can maintain at company code level. So it can be applicable for all. Got it my point everyone? Got it, ma'am? Yes. Uh, same is applicable for customers and vendors as well. Vendor and customer we will discuss later, ma'am. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Yeah. Next one. Put the heading of exchange rates. Put the heading of exchange rates, everyone. Put the heading of X. What is meant by exchange rate? Exchange rate, Poleto. Please now unmute and speak. Anyone, please? Different currency. Uh, ma'am, tell me, ma'am. Uh, Saurabh ji, Poliya ji. Rate other than uh, local currency. Okay, super, super. Very good. Mm -hmm. Any others? Our currency to another currency exchange. Excellent, very good. Uh, one currency to another currency. Mm -hmm. Elaborate it more, anyone? More, more? Cost of converting one currency to another, local currency to foreign or foreign to local. Excellent, excellent answer. Cost of currencies, yeah. Mm -hmm. So, everyone, let it be time out. Huh? Can we discuss tomorrow? Okay. Yes, sir. Exchange rate. Yes, sir. Discuss too. Guys, so my, my special request is everyone. So please join on time, everyone. So we are losing almost 10 minutes. Okay. We will discuss some more subject. Huh?
Say yes or no. Will you join on time tomorrow onwards? Yes. Yes. Sir. Yes. Sir. Sir. yes. yes. Very, good. Very good. Thank you, everyone. Bye, everyone. Bye. US and Australia. Hello? Sure.